those. So your first card, we got two nice, and I clarified that. And then we have sad, depressed, and I clarified that one also. So Leo, you guys may have came together with somebody. Whoever this is, this is somebody that may have spoiled you. Maybe they spoiled you with attention. Maybe they spoiled you with gifts. Maybe they took you out on dates. You know, and, you know, y'all have spent some quality time with this person, Leo. And I feel like this person began to make things official with you, Leo, because we got the Hierophant right here. So some of you guys got together with somebody and made it official and decided to be in a commitment with this person. The rest of you guys, this could be somebody that you was already dealing with before, but then y'all end up reconciling with each other. And, um, and this person began to spoil you. So y'all take how the story went out of those two options. But I am clearly seeing that somebody got together with somebody. It's either that you ended up being in a commitment with this person or you decided to get together with somebody that was already in a commitment with somebody else. Either or. So it's either that you was committed already or this person was already committed elsewhere, although they were spoiling you, Leo. Because some of y'all could have been like the side piece. The rest of you guys, maybe you didn't know that this person was in a relationship with somebody else, although it was in a relationship with you. But most of y'all did know if this person was in a committed relationship elsewhere. You did know that. But I am seeing that somebody be somebody started to gain disappointed because we got sad and depressed. And I feel like it's all because of somebody's victory somebody was disappointed about somebody's status i'm getting jealous energy so somebody may have been jealous have grown some form of jealousy over somebody's status like maybe this is somebody that had their own real estate business for an example um maybe they own a car dealership or um maybe this is somebody that has it all together like they have their own house they own car you know they got everything in order you know their own business whatever it is but i'm getting some jealousy energy where somebody have began began disappointed and start to grow some form of jealousy over somebody's happiness over somebody's victory and it could be the person that's being spoiled that already knew this person was in a committed relationship elsewhere you see what i'm saying because it's like somebody could be wanting that you know wanting everything like they want the man, they want the car, they want the house, they want everything, even though they already been spoiled by somebody, by the same person that they were jealous of, it's like they want everything that comes with this person, although they may be in another relationship, so, so some of you guys could be in a, some of y'all could be the side piece, and maybe this could be your energy, y'all, this energy could be vice versa, the rest of y'all, it could be the other way around. Somebody could be jealous of you and what it is that your person doing for you. And it's like this person wants your life. You see what I'm saying? That's the energy that I'm picking up on. But for the most part, there is somebody who's already in a commitment with somebody else behind the scenes. But they spoil in a whole other person. You see what I'm saying? And um, that person is starting to... Is they want everything that comes with this person. They don't really want them to be in a relationship with the person that they're actually committed to. Although they're spoiling them and giving them what they want. It's like they want everything that comes with this person. Like I said, somebody wants somebody's life. Somebody wants somebody's man. Wow. We got main female right here. Didn't I say that somebody, this is somebody that they actually are not in a commitment with. And some of y'all will keep it real. Some of y'all could be y'all, Leo. Maybe you're not actually committed to this person, but this is somebody that could be like a sugar daddy or sugar mama or somebody that spoil you, give you money, give you gifts, take you out on dates, you know, stuff like that. And they got a, a whole woman at home. You know what I'm saying? But for the most part, this is, could be, or it could be the other way around, but this is somebody that they are not actually in a commitment with. And they could be jealous of that person's lifestyle, jealous of this person's house car it's like they want the whole package that comes with the person basically they want the whole nine you know what i'm saying but we're gonna dive a little bit deeper and see what else is taking place what else do we got yeah if somebody is not happy about you know somebody's status somebody's this you know family or relationship or whatever they got going on with another person it's like they want somebody's life or they want somebody's man or somebody's woman or something they want the lifestyle basically that comes with the person what else clear intuitive messages we got the three of wands right here 
So some of y'all, there is someone who's getting ready to leave their main female to make it happen with the side piece. Because we got the main female reversed, and then we have the three of wands. So somebody is actually getting ready to make you a solid commitment. It could be you, Leo. We're going to use you as an example, Leo. But it's because, like I said, this is somebody who... This is somebody who wants to make it official with you, Leo, basically. They want to make it official with you. Um, they want to come together with you. They want to be with you, Leo. I am getting that. This is somebody that actually has a lot of fun with you. Some of y'all may have went surfing with this person. Or you went to the beach with this person. Or maybe you went to, like, a carnival or a festival with this person. Um, of course, not everybody. But this is somebody that has, a, you know, quite a good time with the person that is spoiling them. You know what I'm saying? That's the energy that I'm seeing. But somebody's getting ready to lead a main female to make it happen with you, Leo, or make it happen with that side piece. We got, wow, this is somebody that they've been sneaking around with. Because I feel like the main person don't really know what's going on behind the scenes. But this is somebody who may have been sneaking around with the other person. Wow, the world card is because whoever they got at home, they're not happy with that person. You know what I'm saying? They don't feel like they belong to that person. But I am getting that energy where somebody feels like their life is incomplete. So they go and mess around on a person with the side piece, to spoil the side piece, and have fun with the side piece. You see what I'm saying? This is somebody who is definitely being sneaky, you know, because they feel like, their, their, their life is incomplete. Didn't I say somebody is getting ready to make some form of a commitment? Somebody is getting ready to come back around and commit to you, Leo. It could be you. I'm going to use you as an example. Or it could be the other way around. But somebody is getting ready to make some form of com commitment. Because, like once again, I said, whoever they're in a relationship with, they're not happy with that person. You see what I'm saying? And... I just felt like you being in this person's energy, this person is the happiest when they're around you, Leo. Because we do got the Six of Wands right here also. And it's like the relationship that they are in with these, with this other person that they're getting ready to dump. They are feeling very sad and depressed and always mad at that person, Leo. I'm hearing that the, the person that they're committed to is always mad. You know, maybe they always got an attitude or something. That's probably why the per your person do what they do behind the scenes with you is because, you know, of their main chick or their main man. You see what I'm saying? But there is a commitment on the way after somebody um, ended with someone. I don't feel like they left yet, but they will leave because they want... To make, they want to get things in order with the other person. But what else do we have, Spirit? Clear intuitive messages, please. Wow. Somebody could be turning the side piece to the main piece. Then I say that something is getting ready to end and something is getting ready to begin with somebody. Wow. It's because I don't even think somebody's heart was in it for real like that. Somebody's heart was not in it. So somebody is definitely getting ready to end a relationship because their heart was never really in it. And, and then not only that, I feel like they always holding some form of resentment. Like the main female that they're getting ready to leave, this, that person is always mad. That's the energy that I'm, that I'm getting. Always mad at them in a way. But it's because somebody been being deceptive. We got the Seven of Swords twice on the board. If somebody was being deceptive. Somebody was being sneaky. Somebody was lying. Somebody was cheating. It's because the, fa the main female knew something was up anyways, but they didn't know exactly with who. And um, and that's why the nagging was going on with the main female is because they knew that the person was being deceptive. The person was stepping outside of their relationship. That's what I'm seeing. And um, I'm seeing some form of resentment. 
but somebody who's being deceptive, somebody who's being sneaky. Wow. Come to find out it's because this person, once again, they never, their heart was never in it. They never really loved the other person. They never really loved, and they get ready to leave that person. They get ready to dump the main female. Wow. That's crazy because somebody was not happy. Somebody was not happy. They just was not. They feel like somebody was just holding on to somebody that was just, they was just taken care of out of obligation. Maybe they felt like they had to stay there out of obligation. Maybe because they got kids or maybe because they felt like they needed to take care of that person because they always was the type of person to take care of the person because it was a breadwinner with the six of wands right here. And I am clearly seeing that they was only there out of obligation. They wasn't really in love with that person. So they getting ready to commit to the side piece. And it's crazy because the side piece win. Because it's like the side piece got exactly what it is that they want. Because like I said from the beginning, they wanted the full package that comes with the person. They wanted that person's man. Or they wanted that person's life in general. It may not even be just... You know, that it could just be in general, want everything because, you know what I'm saying? But show enough, the breadwinner is making that decision and they're making it happen. Look, we got the Empress right here. They coming back. They coming back. Some of y'all be careful because the person that's the breadwinner could be, getting, may end up getting you pregnant. But I am clearly seeing that there's a new beginning. And something is about to blossom in this new, in this new relationship. It's like the side piece is no longer the side piece no more. They could be coming to baby mama. Look, then I say that six of pentacles. Somebody could be coming to baby mama and, and have a family elsewhere with the side piece. That's exactly what I'm saying. Somebody chose the side piece. They want the side piece to be their main piece. So they can have a family with and have something stable. Which is leaving somebody pissed off because we got the Emperor card reversed. And this, this situation is out of the other person's control. It really is. Clear intuitive messages, please, for, for Leo and a person. What else? We need one more card. Yeah. Five of Swords right here reversed. It's like as soon as they left, they just left without saying anything because they didn't want to argue with that person. They just up and left. That's the energy that I'm seeing. They just up and left the other person, which left the other person, the baby, the, the main female, ticked off because they didn't even get a chance to even say anything. And that's probably, once again, why the other person was cheating because of the nagging. But at the same time, that does not justify their actions. You see what I'm saying? But... That's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing that the side piece is basically the main piece now. And leaving the main piece, you know, upset over this ending, over this breakup. Because they have been deceived the whole time in this relationship. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up, Leo. Hope it resonates. Y'all be blessed.